I, I saw a picture of you and Jodie Foster, you and Christy McNichol. It's so funny how back in the 70s, we didn't know. Like, did you did you know that Jodie Foster was gay or Christy McNichol was, or was that not even talked about? Michael, no. You, you had no idea? No clue. Michael uh, Jackson? Yeah. Uh, do you think he was? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I, <laughs> I think so, too, but, you know, you never. Yeah. Now, why do you say, yeah, like, convincingly? Did you know him? Yeah. Yeah, there's, there's, there's a story in there, too, about uh, him and I doing a television show we did in, in uh, Swiss Germany, in German-Swiss uh, area, Les Angles. And um, he asked me what it was like to masturbate. What did you tell him? I told him, uh, you can find out for yourself. Uh, you know, I, I, I wasn't, I wasn't going to show him. Do you, think right. he, was he, do you think he was into you? Is that what... I don't know. I, I would imagine, yeah. Like that he was kind of trying to set something up. Yeah, who yeah. knows? And you're like, let's nip this in the bud right now. Yeah. Looking yeah. back, do you kind of wish you had done it just for a great story? No. <laughs> no, not at all. I mean, Why? Thanks, thanks. I'm not attracted to Michael Jackson, but do if I... you feel I, like Jim? Okay, Michael Jackson comes to you. I'd jerk off with him. You would? Absolutely. He's Michael Jackson. He's but, a king of pop. But then again, back then... Uh, he, just how, a good egg. Right. What it's, era of Michael Jackson was this? Back in '78. This is the of the wall. This, this is no. Oh. This is this is when he's with the the the, the, the Jackson Five. Oh, he was still oh, with like Jackson yeah. Five. Later years of the Jackson Five. Okay, but you got that energy from him that he was more than just asking. Oh yeah. yeah. So were you surprised? You said something too in one of your interviews about. Uh, I want to say it was something about you said every chicken hawk wants a part of you because you were a young guy. You were like 14, 15. What, are you chicken hawk? Are you talking about the kid touchers and yeah. What was that experience like? Because now everybody's talking about it, and it's kind of yeah. They well, it was just you know they all wanted to uh, they all wanted to get to know me better. They all wanted to hang out, take quaaludes. Who producers or guys no, that were no, your no. age or older? Just guys, older guys. Yeah, people that I wanted to avoid. Yeah, and you knew. I mean, were you able to figure out oh, pretty yeah. quickly who to avoid here Hell and yeah. what what people's motives yeah. were? My my bottom is still virgin. <laughs> Good for you. Yes. Good for you. Congratulations yes. on that. Thank did you. they? Tr- but did they try? Oh yeah. So how? What, what do you credit you being smart enough to avoid those situations to? Right, because I think a lot of people, it stinks. A lot of people at that age are so eager to be successful. Yeah. That when those situations come up, they feel like, oh, I have to do this, or I want to fit in, or I want to be cool. That just wasn't. It just wasn't something that I was willing to do. Right. It just wasn't there. You know. Did well, they get the vibe that you weren't going to do it, or did they think, were you good at kind of just, like, keeping them thinking, maybe? Yeah, right. <laughs> just yeah, I was keep teasing the him. I was trying to tease him. Well, well no, it. but you got to be, like, not even tease, but you got to no, be... I know what you mean, yeah. but no, 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 nothing like that. Not at all. I think that they, they just, just liked the way I looked. Did your mom know that this stuff was, like... Not really. ...out no. there in the... No, my mom was very trusting. Right. A little too is, trusting. Yeah, not the greatest thing to do when your kids are in show no. business. No. So she would leave you alone with these people, assuming that everything was going to be okay. Yeah. Would you tell her, or you no? Yeah, I, t- I told her sometimes, you know, like stuff, and she was very uh, taken back by it. Was well, she super invested in the yeah. idea of of her kids being like? Did she want you guys in show business? So she didn't kind of want to believe the negative stuff. Yeah. 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 Because if you go and say this is what's going on, right. the only thing she can do is pull you out. But then the show business stuff is over. Right. Exactly. Right. She's but you were, in, yeah. It's it's hard if if your parent and your kid is really good at something. You're like fuck. Well, I know I these don't creeps think... are meaning. I know it's 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 like a shitty thing to have to deal with. I don't have kids, but I mean, I think show business is great. I don't think it's that hard. Yeah, for a parent to be able to be like, okay, let's prioritize here. No, yeah. no, I don't mean that. I mean it's hard to kind of face that this is what it is. Yeah, like it's yeah. kind of hard to have to realize, like, wow, I'm gonna have to take them away from all this fun yeah. stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Want more Jim and Sam? Catch up with full episodes and interviews from celebrity guests anytime on demand using the SiriusXM app.